Hey, it's Summer Scarf 11 with a Lego figure of something I haven't tried yet before, a VTuber. So here's one of my favorite VTubers, Sarah's Fauna from Hollow Live EN. Fauna is fun to watch, and the main reason I chose her to be the first VTuber figure that I tried is because she has my favorite design of any VTuber that I've seen, especially the hair. I really like Fauna's hairstyle and the gradient green in it. So I really wanted to make that kind of hair. The figure ended up being a lot more work than expected, mainly because of the dress. It was a bunch of attempts to figure out how to make the folds in it correctly. So the dress skirt dress and skirt are two different layers and then there's also the sleeve dangly things which are all made out of paper I also like the variety of color added from having all the flowers in her hair. Something I've mentioned before, but I really like designs where one eye is covered because then I don't have to worry about drawing perfectly symmetrical eyes. So even though the hair is 3D and covering it on the outside, I also drew the hair over the eye underneath. Should be pressed down a little bit more, but drew it underneath so that it still looks like it's being covered even when it's not at the right angle. Unfortunately, I couldn't really do much with the Kieran horns. They kind of came out as just simple little block shapes because it was too hard to cut them into detailed antlers. So that is my figure of Fauna. I'm considering doing some other VTuber figures. If you want to see more VTuber figures, then comment below letting me know who you'd like to see a figure of. I can't do anyone that's super complicated, though, with a lot of stuff around them. Like, you know, it would probably be too hard to make all the tentacles in the back. I mean, I could probably make Eno without the tentacles, at least. But if you watch the end, then comment Blossom Dance down below to let me know. And see you next time!